Good morning. In today's Health Watch, the vitamin D dilemma. Vitamin D is hot. Sales have soared to $550 million in 2010. That's up more than 1,000% in less than a decade. That's because vitamin D supplements have been linked to a reduced risk for certain illnesses, like cancers, depression, diabetes, and heart disease. But according to a new study, too much vitamin D may be just as bad as too little. Researchers looked at more than 15,000 adults and found that a marker for inflammation linked to heart disease was higher in people whose blood blood levels of vitamin D were above the low normal range. Recently updated guidelines from the Institute of Medicine recommend that children and adults get 600 international units of vitamin D a day. People older than 70 should get 800. But few foods have a lot of natural vitamin D. Milk is mostly fortified, so one cup equals about 100 IUs. Researchers warn that some extra vitamin D might be good, but too much in certain cases may hurt you. You can have your blood tested to check your levels and determine how much D is right for you. I'm Dr. Holly Phillips.